Theme Customization Theme Skin Settings Go to the official product forum to download the skin first. Download Method 1. Scan the QR code. Jump to the skin download page. 2. Log in to the official website. www.freesats.cn Click GT Media underscore firmware download. Click GT Media GT Series. Android DVB and IPTV box. And then click GT UI Custom Skin. Enter the website to download. Copy the downloaded skin to a USB flash drive. And then insert the USB flash drive into the TV box. 1. The main interface background replacement. In the main interface page, select the custom column. Press OK to enter. It will switch to another page. Select wallpaper. Right click to select image. Press OK to confirm. A window will pop up. Select the background image. Press OK to confirm. The panel of the small window will switch. At this time, press exit to return to the main interface. The background skin of the main interface has been replaced. 2. Tab replacement. 2.1 skin replacement. In the main interface page. Select the custom column. Press OK to enter. It will switch to another page. Select APP entry. Press the right button to select the tab you want to set. Select image and press OK to confirm. A window will pop up. Select the background image. Press OK to confirm. And the panel of small window will switch. At this time, press exit to return to the main interface. And the tab skin has been replaced. Note, we can also design our own personalized skin according to the size provided. 2 point to replacement of tab app column. Select app. Press OK to confirm. A window will pop up. Select the app you want to replace. Let's take YouTube as an example. Press OK to confirm. And the app in the small window will be replaced. At this time, press exit to return to the main interface. And the app column of the tab of the main interface has been replaced. The originally replaced app column will appear at the top. 3. DVB Preview Window Settings In the main interface page, select the custom column. Press OK to enter. It will switch to another page. Select Preview Window. Press the right button. It is open at this time. Press OK to close. At this time, press Exit to return to the main interface. And the TV program Preview Window will display a small icon of DVB player. Select Preview Window. Press the right button. It is closed at this time. Press the OK button to open. At this time, press Exit to return to the main interface. And the TV program preview window will display the TV program. 4. App automatically starts setting when booting. In the main interface page, select the custom column. Press OK to enter. It will switch to another page. Select Startup. Press the right button to select the app you want to set up. Take YouTube as an example. Select YouTube. And press OK to confirm. Next time you open Combo, YouTube will open automatically. If you want to cancel this setting, select Restore in the upper right corner. Press OK to confirm. You can cancel. 5. Open App Shortcut Key Settings. In the main interface page, select the custom column. Press OK to enter. It will switch to another page. Select Custom Key. Press the right button. Take YouTube as an example. Select YouTube.
press OK to confirm. At this time, press the exit button to return to the main interface. Press the custom button on the remote control. AngieTube will automatically open. Six USB access box settings. In the main interface page, select the custom column. Press OK to enter. It will switch to another page. Select Autoplay. Press the right button. It is open at this time. Insert the U disk. There will be a USB pop up. Press the down button on the remote control to collapse the prompt window. Select Autoplay. Press the right button. It is open at this time. Press OK to close. Insert the U disk again. The USB pop up box will not appear. 7. Theme export settings. The import settings. 7.1 export settings. After finishing all the above settings, select export. Press OK. A prompt window will pop up. It will be backed up according to the time. And the system will export to the Lee disk. 7.2 import settings. Select import. Press OK to confirm. A window will pop up. Select the saved theme skin setting file in the U disk. The theme skin will be set according to the previously saved file. 